In this video, I'll be showing you how to factory reset your ROG Xbox Ally X and it's a very simple method. So if you find this video helpful, be sure to drop a like and subscribe. But anyways, getting into it, let's say you're having some issues with your ROG Xbox Ally X and you might want to factory reset it so it's, you know, completely wipes it. It's a clean slate. First thing that you want to do is go ahead and shut down your console. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to press this. This is going to open up my command center. Then I'm going to go over to the left where it has the power button right there. Go ahead and click on that. Then I just want to click shut down. I don't want to restart. I want to do a full shutdown of the console. Then just wait for it to fully turn off and then I'll tell you exactly what to do. Now, firstly, ignore the smudges on my screen, but what you want to do is go ahead and press the power button and turn it on as you usually would once there's no light over here. So go ahead and press that. But while it's turning on, what you have to do is spam press your volume down button, which is right here. So just keep spamming it. And then eventually while you're spamming it, boom, you're going to see the BIOS open up. So what you want to do from this section here is press Y on your controller. That's going to bring up the advanced settings. Now from here, all you got to do is press right on the D-pad and then go to Asus Cloud Recovery, which is the second option. So go ahead and click on that right there. Then you just got to accept the turns and you can read through this if you want to. You just got to press agree right there. Now it's going to say cloud recovery check network information. So all you got to do is just wait for this to load up. Then you're going to basically be able to go through the factory resetting options. You're gonna have to connect to your Wi-Fi, And then, you know, it might take a couple of hours to reset everything, but then you're gonna be on a clean slate. You are gonna have to reinstall things like Armory Crit again and things like that, but you'll be good to go after that. But because you might have to wait a few hours, it's definitely worth plugging your device in and charging it so that your factory reset doesn't get interrupted and nothing goes corrupt. But if you found this video helpful, be sure to drop a like and subscribe and also check out our other ROG Xbox Ally X videos on the channel.